we first met, uh, we were both real active in church and youth group. The churches would have youth rallies, and that's how we met. She was real shy, wouldn't talk to me. She had to have surgery, and so our youth group went to visit her at the hospital. And so I said, hmm, I'll send her some flowers and <laughs> see what that does. And so it started from her in the hospital sending flowers, then we started communicating and started dating. How many years did y'all celebrate this year? Four and a half. Four and a half years. Narrow it down to one thing that, that you could say has helped y'all stay in love. Before we do anything, we usually will ask, pray about it, and then we communicate together on anything. And then we come to a conclusion. It hasn't been a smooth ride all the way. There's been some bumpy roads and some tragedies and things down the way. Supporting one another when the other one's down uh, is how you get through it. If I'm down, well, she can pick me up and hurt and encourage me. At the same time with her, she's down, I want to pick her up and encourage her to, to just keep on trucking on. At the point in your lives now, what are you most looking forward to? You, baby. Me? Yeah. I'm looking forward to spending more time with my children and grandchildren. Um, we enjoy traveling, experience nature. Uh, I love to see wildlife in its habitat and just enjoy to seeing things like that. But, I have a new grandson that's on the way, and I'm looking forward to spoiling him as much as I do my other ones. So we're looking forward to spend quality time with our grandkids. I would say quality time with each other and, and with the grandkids, because we stay so involved and so busy with the businesses right now that it's hard to even slow down and have time for each other sometimes. Having been parents for so long, what would be the most enjoyable thing about raising kids up? Grandkids. <laughs> <laughs> Our kids are great and we love them to death. But I was so involved in the, my career at working. I wanted my children to have things that I didn't have. But as grandparents, you get to kind of slow down and remember those times when your kids were little and you cherish them more with the grandkids because you know those times are going to slip by real easy.